In this question, we are told that there is a triangle ABC which is drawn like this. This is ABC. An angular bisector is drawn from A to BC. And if you are connecting B to that point, this also is an angular bisector. What exactly are we saying? We are saying that this is B and this is C. The angular bisector of A is drawn. It intersects BC at D. This is extended to a point P such that BD is the angular bisector of ABP. So this is equal to this. This is equal to this. What is the property of angular bisectors that we know? The formula for the angular bisectors, that is if you have an angular bisector over here like this. Suppose this is P, this is Q, this is R and this is S. If PS is the angular bisector of the angle QPR, then what uh, we know is that PQ divided by QS is equal to PR divided by RS. That is the angular bisector will divide the opposite side in the exact ratio of the adjacent sides. So if this is A, this will be A into K. And if this is B, this will be B into K. The ratio of these two will be exactly the same as the ratio of these two. In this particular case, we are given the lengths of some of the sides. We are told that BD is 6. So this is equal to 6. We are told that AC is 9. This is 9. We are told that CD is 5. We are told that BP is 8. And we are told that DP is 5. So using the fact that AD is the angular bisector of angle A, we can calculate the length of AB. How can we do that? Because AB divided by 6 is equal to AC divided by CD, which is equal to 9 by 5. AD divided by BD. So AB will be equal to 54 by 5 which is equal to 10.8. So this is equal to 10.8 centimeters. Now if you are looking at the triangle ABP and if you are uh, using the fact that BD is the angular bisector, AB divided by AD will be equal to BP divided by DP. AB we have calculated is 10.8. So 10.8 divided by AD is equal to 8 by 5. Or the value of AD is equal to 54 by 8 which is 27 by 4. This is equal to 6.75 centimeters. So this is equal to 6.75. What are we required to calculate? We are required to calculate the length of AP. That will be equal to 6.75 plus 5 which is equal to 11.75 centimeters which is option B.